Welcome grade fours to today's geography lesson. I'm so sorry that we can't be at school together at the moment, but please know that your grade four teachers are missing you terribly and that we cannot wait to be together again. Over the past few weeks in geography, we have covered some new map work skills. You've looked at what a map is, what a side view and a plan view look like, We've looked at symbols used on a map and a key on a map, as well as some grid reference, which shows us positioning on a map. I'm sure that you've all managed quite well with that work. Today, we are going to be looking at compasses and directions. There are four main directions, north, south, east, and west. And these can be measured or indicated using the compass shown in the picture on the slide. The compass needle always points to north. All right, grade fours, now we're going to have a look at how we can find our directions without using a compass. You can see on the slide in front of you, I've given you a drawing with a young girl called Mandy. In this drawing, Mandy is facing the house and on her right hand side, the sun is rising. The sun always rises in the east. The rock and the tree are also in the east. In this picture, grade fours, Mandy is pointing to the west. The sun sets in the west. The bucket and, to, and the tap are also to her west. On the screen in front of you, grade fours, north is now in front of Mandy. Her right hand points to where the sun rises and her left hand points to where the sun sets. In this picture, the house is north of Mandy and the dog is south of Mandy. Did you know, Grade Force, that there are more than four compass points, that there are actually 16? The way that you can remember the four main ones, north, east, south, and west, is by remembering the little rhyme, never eat silk worms. Never is for north, eat is for east, silk is for south, and worms is for west. That will make it easier for you to remember your four main compass points, but there are also points in between north, east, south, and west. All maps that you get will indicate or show you where north is. Now that we know about the four different compass points showing us direction, we can go outside and complete the activity.